Howdy, this is David Gross, your Texas tax and lawman. 2022 is starting to remind me of the Lord of the Rings, the Fellowship of the Ring. We've started on this noble journey to make the world a better place, to do our best, living one day at a time, when challenge after challenge continues to arise. Thankfully, we made it past the April 15th deadline and continue to prepare clients' returns. Surprisingly, most clients are receiving their refunds in a reasonable time, but some receive less than they anticipated because they could not document the number of stimulus checks they received last year. The truth is good record keeping is critical for accurate tax filing and with all the changing rules and government letters, many clients simply lost track of what was coming or going in their personal bank account. But even more disturbing is a recent report by the Treasurer Inspector General for Tax Administration. This office monitors the IRS and reviews their effectiveness. On May 9th, TIGTA reported that the IRS destroyed 30 million paper filed support documents for individual tax returns. This would be paper filed 1099s, 1099 divs, 1099 NECs, W-2s, and all the critical information that reported what income you received for 2020. While most practitioners file these documents electronically, the IRS simply destroyed the paper file documents because of their tremendous backlog. This means that if we have a dispute with the IRS, the burden is going to be on you and me, the taxpayer, to prove what income we received. This makes me feel like Gandalf trying to direct the Fellowship of the Ring through the minds of Moria. Just remember, with the IRS, it can always get worse. Run! Texas Tax and Lawman Legal Disclaimer. Hey, I'm a lawyer. You know I have to have some lawyer mumbo jumbo. This is a general information video, not client attorney privilege information. The content is information only and is not directed to any specific facts or circumstances and cannot be relied upon as a legal opinion, even though that would be nice and save you a trip to the lawyer. If you have a specific legal question, feel free to contact David Gross directly or seek qualified legal or tax counsel in your state of residence, state of mind, or whatever place you call home.